To attain oneness with the universe, you must rise to the heavens and sit at the foot of the master and bask in his knowledge. Or, if you just want the heaviest hooking, best ball on the market, you can come with Laneside Reviews as we take a look at the Radical Guru. Alright guys, so welcome back. As always, I am the Beast, Rob Johnson, joined once again by Scoops Porter. And as we said, we're looking at the new guru from Radical. Now there's not a lot of companies out there that will put their money where their mouth is, but Radical is definitely one of them. Yeah, now they've just actually released a new video where they've taken some of the top balls on the market, put it in a throw bot, and shown them off against the guru. And well, what you see is what you get. The guru was cleaner, longer, and stronger than anything else out there. Yeah, and we're gonna put a link up in the comments so you guys can check that video out too. Now, the Guru is actually one of the balls that I got to throw while I was out on tour for the World Series of Bowling. So we have a unique opportunity here. Um, yeah, we actually get to test a pin up and pin down ball. So for uh, those of you out there who've wondered what the difference between pin up and pin down is, you're actually gonna get to see a full representation of it with our regular bowlers so you can see just how the ball changes. But rather than listening to how we talk about it, why don't we take a lane side, see how it stacks up. Alright guys, so here we have Wayne Porter, our uh, original white-haired guru. <laughs> uh, he's bowling on the Kegel Street, Main Street oil pattern. Uh, yeah, he is our, our low rev, low speed player, and usually lower hook, but yeah. you, you wouldn't really know it by him playing this ball. No, he loved, he fell in love with this ball, I think before he even threw the ball. Just came, it comes off his hands so clean, so smooth. And, and just for him, uh, he doesn't often retain energy down lane because he doesn't no. have a lot of speed. Exactly. He, he has to throw a lot of pearlized equipment to keep that energy, and man, this ball, it was there the whole way. Now you'll notice uh, something a little different here. The first four shots that we do uh, in this are actually the pin up guru, where the last one is the pin down guru. So we can kind of show you the difference between uh, how the pin up one really snaps off the back of the right. pattern, yeah. where you know, I think this is the uh, the pin down no, one right yeah. here. You'll see it's a much smoother movement. Yeah. Very, very, very smooth off the yeah. end of the pattern. Yeah. Where the rest of Wayne's were, if they got down there, you could see him pop. Pop, yeah. So here's Scoops. Once again, deep inside. Ball hooked up. Just kept rolling. Hey, showing off for his fans <laughs> yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. Somebody cheered. I had yeah. to point it out. Yeah. It's a good ball. Just Play it way up. wider. Yeah. Just right there. And you can see on these on these first few shots, once it leaves the pattern, how yeah. angular, how yeah. very strong it is in its move, yeah. uh, without giving up carry. Yeah, I found that it comes off like that, but it, it, that's what I mean. It it hits and it stays there. Like it it doesn't blow through uh, the rack. It's just when it makes this move, it's there. Yep. You see, you can uh, tell uh, when that ball yeah, leaves the pattern, the pattern yeah. uh, by how strong, strong it leaves. Yeah, exactly. Now and this now, is the pin down one. This is the pin down one. A little tighter. And nice you see, it roll. moves yeah. about three, four feet yeah, earlier. earlier. Yeah. And rather than being snappy, it gets it, that it, arc uh, motion. Yeah, a little bit more control to it. Yeah. And that, I mean, that's what a pin down ball will do for you. Yeah. And you can see me, I really hit it hard there, and I mean, I've... I'm playing it right. Yeah. You can see I'm actually sliding in around center, which, I mean, we've said it before, I'm usually a deep player. Yeah. So I was able to move to the outside so, of the lane yeah. and get it to carry. carry. Yeah. Once again, you're not giving up anything down lane. Yeah, no carry, <clears throat> no problems that way. Yeah. Now you see here, 
moved a little bit deeper, gave it more room, and you can see it, it leaves that yeah, pattern. Yeah. yeah. Woo. Wow. Yeah. 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 See my yeah. face. Ooh. Yeah. And it was definitely it was definitely one of the most um, popular balls on uh, when you were out at the World Series for sure. Yeah. This. I mean, everybody everybody on the Brunswick staff was loving this ball. You can yeah. see. Wow. How yeah. hard it came off the end of the pattern yeah. there. And now you're pinned down. Now we'll switch it up to the pin, pin down. down. And once again, super smooth, well controlled. Yeah, you can see yeah. it started moving. Yeah. I went a little bit high, but you could, yeah. I kept that in. Yeah. So you can see it started moving before the, the hash, hash marks. marks. Yeah. Huge difference. Like, yeah, about 35. Now here's a, a little bit of a different feature for you guys. We've actually put uh, us side by side throwing pin up and pin mm -hmm. down. Now you can see on Wayne's here where the one on the pin up one didn't start moving until much pa much farther down past the hash markers yeah. where on the right hand side it was moving before the hash yeah. markers so you could see he was he closed up his angle, angle. Yeah. probably two or three boards yeah and had a much different look at yeah. the pocket now here's scoops you can see he's about five five boards difference yeah and you, and you can see how much earlier it started the the hooking motion and rolling up yeah yeah you know, he probably had another five boards to the right that he yeah. went, starting five boards First, left. Yeah. Uh, still great carry Beautiful power. carry, yeah. And it's a good thing to have if you start getting tapped with one ball and switching to the other one will give you a slightly different angle with a similar roll. Yeah, now here you can see a huge difference. Yeah. And you can see I am at least five boards difference. Yeah. I swung the pin-up ball five boards farther out right. Yeah. Uh, and the ball started about five feet earlier. Earlier, yeah. So you can see how that... That pin up versus pin, pin down, down drilling, yeah. fast response versus slow, slow response, response. Yeah. how it affects how the ball rolls. Yeah. All right, guys, that about wraps it up for another show. If you like what you saw this episode and want to find out more, don't forget to follow us on Facebook at Laneside Reviews. You can also follow us on Twitter at Laneside Reviews and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And now you can find us online at lanesidereviews.com. So until next time, guys, we'll see you Laneside. This program sponsored by Turbo Driven to Bowl for all the quad two inserts and switch grip interchangeable thumbs we use in all of our equipment. Dexter Bowling Shoes, the world's most advanced shoe, the SST8. Bowlerama Berry, for all the lanes we bowl on. For birthday parties and corporate events, call now. Still searching for that perfect fit? With no residue and easy removal, Real Bowler's Tape really is the Real Bowler's Choice. And Plantronics, rig, stereo headset and mixer for streaming, gaming, and more. Play more, pause less.